I'm Chris Ceremus, Matt Lauder, Cattle TV. We're here at the 2011 Kansas State Fair. We're currently in our grand champion market hog drive. Appreciate our sponsor, DWE Livestock, the Dylan Evans family. We've got a great lineup of hogs out here in our drive. Standing here, the Maverick Squires, a very uh, well versed uh, hog producer. Maverick, what do you think of this lineup? Uh, extremely interesting set of barrows out here, and uh, looks like he's got a good set of hogs in terms of being consistent all the way through. Look good, look to be real good. Certainly a really stout set from top to bottom. One of our favorites, I think, is that light cross. We think that one certainly got the chance to be the top hog here. Certainly lots of bone and, and power and shape, and still certainly sound enough on his feet and legs as he goes. As far as the hogs, as you're concerned, obviously I know you like the light cross Maverick, but any other hogs that stand out to you that have a chance to maybe beat that one? Oh yeah, I think there's another barrow in here that's pretty neat. Uh, Dark Cross is belted barrow in front of us. I think he's pretty unique in terms of rib shape and moderation and still having squareness. I think he's pretty unique compared to that other crossbred because he's got some more rib shape and he's more opened up. I think he's got some neat things about him. And Galen's going to like that. I mean, he likes rib shape and squareness and uh, that comes from being from Oklahoma, I guess. I guess, obviously, uh, you know the hog business a lot better than we do. I guess, can you give us a little background on our judge and uh, where he's from and uh, sort of his background in the hog business? Oh, yeah. Galen uh, graduated. Galen McCune graduated from Oklahoma State University in uh, 1980. Uh, he's been in the state of Oklahoma. He's... If you asked a panel of 10 people, they would all recommend Galen McCune to be one of the best uh, doing what he does, and that's this hog deal, and that's what he loves doing. That's where his passion lies, and uh, just extremely sharp at reading hogs, and he's great with educating young minds about what this deal's all about. So Galen does a really good job, and uh, he's been an ag teacher for a number of years, and he also had great plains genetics in Oklahoma and ran a boar stud for a long time. So uh, he's been around this deal for a long, long time and got a lot of wisdom. Well, it certainly sounds like our judge, uh, Galen McCune from Oklahoma, is very deserving of the opportunity to judge the Kansas State Fair, and he'll do a great job, as we can see from this lineup, an outstanding lineup of Barris, as Maverick said. Once again, I'd like to thank our sponsor, DWE Livestock, uh, the, the, the Dylan Evans family. Dylan's got an outstanding uh, hog operation going, if I'm not mistaken. He's been putting some great hogs in some great homes and been very, very successful the last few years. So once again, I'd like to thank Dylan Evans and all his support bringing you this live or this coverage of the Grand Champion Hog, and yes, it'll be the Grand Champion Light Cross to be your overall Supreme Market Hog. Maverick, any final thoughts on that great bear right there? Uh, congratulations to the family who uh, has him, and congratulations to whoever raised him, because that's a pretty darn good one. Certainly an outstanding hog. Congratulations to that young man right there, very deserving. Certainly was probably the overwhelming favorite out here, at least from what we could see. I think it gets a little bit closer for reserve, but I would imagine that dark cross, as you said, Maverick, will be the one to probably be reserved. Uh, are you going to stick with that one? Um, I know this black-headed guilt's pretty interesting, too, but I'm probably going to go ahead and leave my bet on the belted barrel. What's yours? Well, I like that uh, guilt there, the, the black-headed guilt. She's certainly really neat to look at, but that uh, dark cross probably appears to have just a little more shape and and power to me, I guess, from the way I read them. But the two exemplary uh, hogs here in the Grand Champion Drive, he certainly could go any direction. <laughs> Looks like it's a little bit closer than that champion. The judge is taking a little bit more time as he evaluates this pick for reserve. And yes, it'll be the Dark Cross, if I'm not mistaken, to be your reserve Grand Champion Market Hog at the Kansas State Fair. Congratulations to that young lady. It looks like the crosses will sweep the show here. The light cross to win and our uh, dark cross to be reserved grand. Congratulations to both of these exhibitors. Once again, thanks to DWE Livestock. Uh, I really appreciate Dylan Evans' support. Be sure to check out his fall offering. He's got a great uh, offering of show pigs throughout the year.